Hi everyone, it's Michelle Barada and welcome to Bella Branch TV. Today's DIY is going to be another no sew project. It's one of my most requested DIYs that I do. And um, so this one is going to be a cylinder shaped pencil case. And it's perfect for back to school. Look how cute that is. It's so easy to make and you will not believe what I use to make it. So you guys ready to get started? Well, let's go. What you'll need for this project is fabric, scissors, a hot glue gun, a zipper, and the inside of a paper towel roll. First take your paper towel roll and you're going to measure the length of your zipper. Now mine's seven inches and you're going to mark the length and then you're going to cut that off. Then you're going to split the paper towel whole roll in half. and now you're gonna add your zipper. Place your zipper with the zipper side down and put hot glue on the edge of one side. And then do the same thing on the other side. Then you're gonna take your fabric and put it right side down and trace around the bottom of the cylinder. Then cut around with about a half inch allowance and then snip all the way around. Then put hot glue around the edge of the cardboard tube, place it on the center of the cut fabric, and now flip up those little cut pieces all the way around. This is so it'll lay flat, that's why we made the little snips on the outside. And you're gonna repeat this on the other side as well. Now take the other piece of fabric and you're going to make a little seam allowance. Fold it over about a half inch on one side, then lay the tube down right to the edge and measure the other side so you know where to cut, trim, and fold to have a seam allowance on that side as well. Now place the tube on top of the fabric again. And what you're doing is you're measuring to make sure that when you fold over to make a clean edge on the seam allowance that you're going to leave enough room. So now one side I'm going to fold over and make a clean edge. And that, that side looks like about a half inch. Then I'm going to add that right on the outside of the zipper and hot glue that down. Now you're going to bring the bottom up and you're going to make another clean edge on that side and then fold that up. And this one is a little less just because the way the fabric ended up uh, being. Now you're gonna roll it up and glue and roll it up and glue right on the edge. And then when you get to the end, you're gonna go across the top of the zipper and now you have a pencil case. Look how cute that is. And you guys know I like to embellish, so now I added some red velvet trim on each side to complete the look. And it's ready to put my pencils inside. I hope you guys loved today's DIY. I think it turned out fantastic. It was so easy to make and you can really customize it to whatever style. Now I picked a floral style, but really you can pick any style that is, you know, that's you. So. Before you go, you may want to check out some of my other videos. They're going to be up on the screen now. Just click on the video that you see and you can keep DIYing. And until next time, have an awesome week, everyone. Bye.